Hello everybody, my name is Michael from Polygon Island, and today I'm doing it. I'm doing something that pretty much every artist on the planet has done, and that is the 10 minute, 1 minute, 10 second challenge. Um, so if you guys don't know what this is, basically I have three different time frames to make three different renders, and those time frames are 10 minutes, 1 minute, and 10 seconds. So it's pretty much self-explanatory. Um, let's get into it. So, I'm going in this with absolutely no idea of what to do at all whatsoever. So, set a timer for 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Let's go. Okay. Um, 9 minutes. Okay. So, first thing I'm going to do is I, I'm going to... Oh, God. Where did I save it at? Oh, this is not good. Is it this one? Is this the rigged one? Yes, this is the rigged one. Okay, we're good. We're good. I'm fine. Uh, okay, so basically, uh, I'm going to go ahead and pose this guy. That looks so unnatural. What's wrong with him? Why doesn't he look natural? Does he need to be out a little bit more? Uh, 8 minutes and 35 seconds. Oh, boy. This is not good. This isn't good. This isn't good, I'm going to be honest. Uh, what do I want? Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and give him that little halo that is in literally every one of my renders. It's a lot more stressful than you guys think. Because if I don't get this by the time that the time runs out, then I'm not going to get it. Okay, we're going to do that. Uh, make this kind of like crystal shape, I guess. I did a render similar th to this before. I don't know if that's cheating or not. But I'm not going to count it. As cheating I don't care about the geometry of this at all I know the topology is just god-awful but that's not really what I'm worried about right now uh, we're gonna we might give this one sub to that does not look good at all uh, sculpting sculpting is always saves me sculpting always saves me uh, flatten dynamic topology okay I don't know what kind of crystal this is but uh, we're gonna use this and bring it down six minutes and 38 seconds oh boy we're gonna have you like that okay so we're gonna give oh materials we're gonna give you uh, a glass with a very high roughness and then probably material just selected I did that right okay I did that right uh, we're going to bring you, we're going to turn your power down to like, what, like 25? We're going to give you a pinkish glow. We're going to bring you over here into the crystals. 5 minutes and 38 seconds. 5 minutes and 38 seconds. Okay, we're going to bring you into the crystals, I guess. Um, I don't know, I guess I'll put the the camera. Um, we're going to use cycles, GPU compute, 1080 by 1080. Uh, camera now we're gonna add a volume cube and we are going to disconnect this give it a principal volume 0 0.06 maybe let's see how this looks this could look awful okay okay it doesn't look that bad it doesn't look that bad okay it could be worse it could be worse um, let's make this guy glossy give him a low roughness uh, oh yeah this has to be black Okay, that's what we have right now. Okay, four minutes and 40 seconds. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a little bit more of those crystals. Okay, so now we got this crystal. Okay, we're Gucci. Um, let's give material two. Okay, that's the glass material. That's good. Three minutes and 24 seconds. Okay. Uh, we're gonna bring this like this okay we're gonna take this light we're gonna duplicate it once right here change the size to 0 0.05 um, and then do that let's see how that looks okay um, this thing this thing uh, oh god no not that um, this thing needs to go down. Oh, God. That does not look good. Um, this thing needs to be rotated a little bit up. Okay. 
Okay, I think that looks fine enough. Um, what can I add in the background? What can I add in the background? Uh, maybe if I add just some abstract shapes. We're just adding abstract shapes now. Um, okay. Uh, and we're gonna give this guy an emission with. Oh, we're gonna give him a purple with a mission of five. No, no, copy material is selected. Does that look okay? Does that look okay? I think that looks okay. I think that looks okay. I have to up the resolution on these curves, though. Okay, resolution on the curves is up. Uh, a minute left. I'm going to count that as done because um, there's not really anything I can do with this minute. But I'm going to render this out, and I will show you the render. Okay, 10 minutes is done. It'll be up on the screen now. Um, this does include post-processing that I've done after that. Uh, I don't know if that's really cheating or not, but um, I'm self-conscious, so we're adding post-processing to these renders, okay? Um, so I know at the start of this video, I said that I wasn't going to do the same render each time, but I probably am, just to see how they change, how they change throughout the time frames. So now we have a one minute um, to do this. So set a timer for one minute. Your timer is set for one minute. Okay, we gotta go. Okay, I don't know, uh, I still don't know where, uh, that guy saved to. Um, is it, is it? It's this guy. How much time do we have left? 20 seconds! Okay, you know what? You know what? This guy is just getting this. Um. Okay. Okay, now that did not go how I expected it to, um, but nonetheless, I am a man of my word, um, so I'm just gonna move the camera to about here, change the camera settings, since I'm not actually changing anything with the render, and we're about to see how this looks, I guess. At least I tried. At least I tried. Okay. Um, well, anyway, I'm going to render this out and put it on the screen, too. Uh, okay, so this on the screen now is the one-minute render. Um, obviously the best render in the existence of the entire world. But for the sake of my sanity and for the sake of actually being able to render at least something out, um, for this 10-second render, I have brought the mesh in. Um to a blender um so i don't waste like 40 of my 10 seconds trying to uh find the mesh so anyway i'm just gonna scale them up real quick okay i'm pretty sure that's fair i would say that's fair you know like i'm doing this to myself i would say that's fair to give me at least some leverage but anyway i'm not gonna show you the phone this time because that will lose like eight seconds so set a timer for 10 seconds Okay, um, okay, time's up, T -t time's up, T -t I didn't even get to, <sighs> man, this is, this is something alright, well, Just the camera settings here. We're gonna give this a nice generous 250 samples, okay? 256 by 256, okay? Uh, 1080 by 1080. Okay, we're just gonna move the camera. Okay, let's bring it back a little bit. Let's see how this looks like. Oh boy. Oh, this is great. That's great. Well, I'm gonna render this out and show you guys what this looks like, and then I'm gonna compare them all three side by side for you. So, on the screen now is the 10 second render. And on the screen now 
are all three renders maybe if they're not then no well but um this is a little bit of a different video uh hopefully you guys enjoyed it hopefully i didn't embarrass myself too badly but if you guys did enjoy this video and enjoy these types of videos make sure to leave a like and subscribe 97 percent of you aren't subscribed so just like do that it helps my videos get discovered by other people and helps grow the channel but thanks guys so much for watching my name is michael from polygon island and i'll see you guys next time bye